Let's dive right in. The first one is pretty simple. All you have to do is give your phone a fresh restart. For iPhone 10 or later, press and quickly release the volume up button. Press and quickly release the volume down button. Then press and hold the side button. Let it go when you see the Apple logo. Moving on, the next method is offload unused apps in your iPhone storage settings. You can also head to a specific app and offload it one at a time. Besides that, Safari holds a lot of data caches on your iPhone. So our next step is clear its history and website data. In apps like Snapchats, you can also find clear caches option in its settings. Moving on, the recently deleted pictures or videos in your Photos app also takes up a lot of space. So it'd be a wise move to do it manually instead of letting your iPhone empty it every 30 days. Your next best bet would be erase all content and settings. Before you proceed with that, make sure to upload your data to iCloud. And then, after the process is done, you can restore everything back from your backup and then the caches will be gone by then. Well, that sounds a bit complicated, right? We do have a better option here. Repair iOS with Rayboot, which can free up space on your iPhone without restoring. Once connected to your phone, click Start on the home screen. We'll go with the standard repair so we can maintain the data. Rayboot prepares the firmware. Once downloaded it, we can start repairing. This process takes about 10 minutes. When the repair is completed, you can go ahead and check it out. 